This morning, the LAPD is trying to determine if an attack on diners in Beverly Grove was a hate crime. That violent incident was caught on camera, Bob DeCastro, live outside the restaurant where it all went down. And that video was quite incredible, Bob. Good morning. Yeah, we'll show you that in just a moment. It happened late last night outside this restaurant on La Cienega. This is Sushi Fumi on La Cienega. There were some diners out here. They say it was a peaceful night. And then some protesters driving by back and forth in a caravan started screaming expletives to them. Apparently, somebody who was dining screamed something back. And that's when the protesters got out of the vehicles. And they say attacked the diners. There was a confrontation, and it was captured on cell phone video. Take a look. So the person who took this cell phone video said they were all having a peaceful night. They were talking about wedding plans when they saw this, what they call a caravan of pro-Palestinian protesters driving back and forth on La Cienega. They had these large Palestinian flags and they were screaming, blank Israel, blank the Jews. Well, someone that was dining, said something back to them, said an expletive, and that's when those protesters got out of the vehicle and there was this brawl. Apparently, someone took a stanchion. They were swinging the stanchion around that was used for a velvet rope. There were also, uh, someone took pepper spray and pepper spray was sprayed and there were bottles that were thrown. Now, finally, the cops got here. The ambulance got here. The crowd dispersed. There were no arrests. People ran off. Police described the attackers, as they call them, as wearing all black and they're trying to look to identify them and they are investigating this as, as a hate crime. The good news is that none of the diners were seriously hurt. There were no no major injuries and no one was transported to a local hospital. I will tell you, if you know this area, this is a heavily populated area where there's a Jewish population. There was an Orthodox community that's nearby. And so police are concerned about other harassment or threats against Jewish Americans. There have been a few last night and they're looking to see whether any of those can be connected. Of course, if you have any information, you're urged to call police. That's the latest from Beverly Grove. Bob DeCastro, we'll send it back to you. Bob, thank you.